Bossa à l'OTA, Bossa à l'OTA, continua. Victoria, Victoria à Sata, Victoria, Victoria à Sata, Victoria, Victoria, Bossa, Victoria, Bossa, Victoria à Sata. Deliberations will be made, and after careful deliberation and consideration of the concerns, the Convention Planning Committee, by a majority vote, passed a vote of no confidence on the Chairman of the Convention Planning Committee, Adamu Kabrai Motazu. The vote of no confidence was passed after deliberation on the following reasons. One, the Chairman of the Convention Planning Committee displayed a clear abuse of office an undeniable bias in his actions and decision-making which threatened the fairness and impartiality of the convention process. Two, the breach of constitutional and Senate decision, coupled with the autocratic disposition adopted by the chairman in suspending unjustly the chairman's subcommittee on screening without excuse approval or deliberation was deemed detrimental to the democratic values and principles that NANS uphold. Three, there were allegations of financial inducement which compromised the integrity of the entire CPC and the chairman to anchor the convention process going forward. Four, after clear and exhaustive deliberation on the numerous petitions against the chairman bordering on these issues, the resolutions are as follows. The Convention Planning Committee therefore resolved to remove the Chairman of the Convention Planning Committee from his position, effective immediately. In his state, the Convention Plan, the Vice Chairman of the Convention Planning Committee will assume the role of Acting Chairman pending renomination by the appointing authority, which is the NANS National Secretariat, led by the NANS President, to ensure a smooth and more transparent and also an unbiased convention planning. The decision to remove the chairman of the Convention Planning Committee, Comrade Adamu Matazu, was taken in the best interests of the organization, NANS, and its commitment to upholding transparency and fairness in all its activities. The decision also takes into account the petitions that we have received as the Secretariat, reflecting the lack of confidence of Nigerian students in the Chairman of the CPC to anchor a free, fair, and credible convention. I rise with prime complacency to accept this responsibility to head the leadership of the Convention Planning Committee of this amiable organization of ours, the National Association of Nigerian Students. Today marks a unique day in the history of NANS as far as our days in the struggle are concerned, as we, to the part, to, to the part of this innovative stride that seeks to re restore sanity in our lofty organization in the interest of keeping NANS on the, the perfect trajectory. The former Convention Planning Committee Chairman, Comrade Adamu Kabir Matazu, whose office ceased to exist after the resolution of the principal officers of the organization allowed himself to be cajoled into personalizing the organization. The leadership deficiency incited, by, incited the removal of the former chairman. However, NANS will continuously progress no matter whose ox is God, and any interest that seeks to annihilate the voice of Nigerian students must be resisted at all costs. I pledge to the entirety of Nigerian students, the voice of their tribe, region, and religion, with zero exceptions to their social status, to defend, to deliver a credible, free, fair, and acceptable election. I promise you most assuredly that we shall not allow our interests to surpass the common interests of Nigerian students, no matter the pressure on us as leaders. Let me use this opportunity to appreciate our grand patron of NANS, the man who has dedicated his life for the, country, for the progress of Nigerian students. He has demonstrated exceptional leadership qualities, even while serving as governor. He is now the Minister of Defense. His name is Dr. Abubakar Badaru, the Minister of Defense, the grand patron of NANS. We appreciate you. 
as our grand patron, you have done exceptionally well to Nigerian students. Let me also appreciate the man who have placed, who, the man who have placed exceptional uh, professionalism in the discharge of his responsibility. That is the most revered, the most enviable, the most respected director of the state, the state security services, uh, Bichik. You who have shown to the whole world that he is an exceptional person. Uh, let me also appreciate our father, the defender of North Central, uh, Honorable George Akume, the secretary to the government of the Federation.